UFC Heavyweight Division Collision. Boxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive these into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level, yeah. from everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem at Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once. I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. And now our tail of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Four years apart, some differences in height and reach. Here once more, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. If he's a coach, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Abu! And now if he sees a moment. Fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. They touch him up, and we are underway. trying to shut the liver down. Nice kick. Just misses with a left hook there. He's throwing every part of himself. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Don't finish his fight. Well, you know about the offense, but how about the defense? Overhand blocked by Lee. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Albuquerque. 
draw. Hook lands. Good punch land. How about that shin? He is all about that left kick to the body. Some fighters don't check a lot of leg kicks. That one was checked. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Pretty nice knee there, DC. Great job finding the opportunity to land that strike. Throws the right hand there. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Big ball for punch land. Now he gets back to range. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, he's got it going tonight. Beautiful combination of strikes there by Lee. Right punches there. Look at him top of the wood. Top of the wood with those leg kicks. Switching stances here. Oh, he landed that knee to the midsection. Got to think his opponent's going to feel that one in the morning. And he's going to continue to throw that strike because he knows that his opponent can't take many of them. Well, he is at his kickboxing desk tonight. Another nice, good series of kicks by him there. I mean, the kicks are coming in bunches. Normally, it's the hands. Tonight, he's throwing kick after kick after kick. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action, but the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed that put him on wobbly legs and then survival mode. Luckily, he made it to the end of that round. Big punch man over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Nice defense there, huge block. This might be the biggest shot of this entire fight. He landed a massive hook to put his opponent on wobbly legs. Lands flush with that right hand. Big head kick land. Oh, here's the head kick, it's blocked. Now Pugh gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. And both guys really throwing with authority. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly Found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. Oh, I'm 
round it was the big knockdown courtesy of that kick that that nearly closed the show for good it almost closed the show but nothing's more discouraging than when you get somebody hurt that bad and you don't shut the door he has to go back to work now knowing that he's got about as tough a guy as if as he's ever had in front of him in the octagon tonight but just out of range. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of... Right there, the seminal blow of the fight. I mean, it was perfect. It was absolutely perfect, John. Great placement on that uppercut. Oh, nice strike landed there by Lee. Just missed on the front kick there. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh! Huge right hand! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Just misses with the straight right. Lee's head kick looked like that one was blocked. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Muay Thai plump. Nice punch, man. Back and forth we go. Oh, well-timed and placed overhand by Lee. Kick to the body now, that one won't land. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh! Oh! Okay, now he's hurt. That's one of those shots that if you take one of them, if you see the night, that one landed right on the spot. The counter jab snaps the head back. That should get his attention. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Oh, what a punch. Look at how he... Oh, oh, he lands another strike to the body here. Really starting to connect on a lot of strikes to the midsection here in the latter stages of this fight. to the well with that right hand, it's no good. 15 seconds to go. Great punch landing with so much power. So trying to double up on that jab. And that'll do it, 15 minutes in the books. All right, there's the end of the round, so it was a huge strike to the head that stunned his opponent and, and nearly got him out of it. Yeah, that was a big moment. A big strike lands. His opponents on wobbly legs. That is exactly what you, what you want to see as you're walking back to your stool. Your opponent staggering back to his corner and being hopeful that he can get it back together before the start of the next round. Landed another great shot to the body. They're really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages of this fight. 
Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Oh, nice. On that punch right there. His opponent's compromised, DC. It's one thing to land a hard shot. It's another thing completely to land a perfect shot. And that was a perfect shot. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's... Oh, thunderous leg kick rounds his opponent, tried to stay upright, but man, that changed the complexion of this fight. Johnny's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Big punch land. Ooh. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Well, the body work starting to take its toll. Look at the redness starting to appear on his left side. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh! Bunches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Big punch lands in the middle. And both fighters exchange in the pocket. Kick is blocked, no damage there. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh! That's a good combination. Oh, nice right hand. 20 seconds now remain in the round. Indicating the end of round four. Nice job out there. Wow. Those power combinations are really paying off. You floored that guy. All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned. A huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to try to change the tide of this fight. You ready? You ready? Here we go, fifth and final round. Oh, high level stuff there as he blocks the strike and counters with a jab. Straight punch lands. Looking to set up that head kick again. This one does not find the head kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it. It was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Oh, nice job there to land the knee strike to the body again, making great use of his length in this matchup. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Abu's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. There's no tell on that, that oh, leg. Thunderous leg, leg kick rounds his opponent and tried to stay upright, but man, that changed the complexion of this fight. Johnny's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Three minutes now to go on the fight. Certain the finish could come at any time. Another knockdown! Oh, thunderous lazy. Lifted a little bit, tried to stay upright, but man, that changed the complexion of this fight. 
John, he's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Liver kick, when you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. All right, good movement by him here on the ground. He really is a master of these transitions. He is a master of movement on the ground. You never know where he's gonna be. One minute to go in the fight. I mean, how many can he take? the ground and pound going now. He's putting him in exactly the positions he needs to be in right now. He's able to relax here. And he understands, being a veteran of so many fights, that as long as he's on top, he's winning. He feels like he's winning here. What else can you say but what a fight? All right, let's look back at some of the action, DC. They go the distance tonight, but you gotta think he won over the judges with his striking acumen tonight. Yeah, you got to watch one of the best strikers in the entire UFC. He did everything so well, and in my opinion, he should cruise to a very easy decision. decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest 50-45, 49-46, and 49-46. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon! So the judges are in agreement tonight. He is your winner by unanimous decision. Certainly pretty easy fight to score, I thought. Yeah, I thought it was 